The Ghana Armed Forces has decried the misconception and negative comments on social media regarding the recent increment in peacekeeping allowance to troops. It said the negative comments intended to downplay government efforts in promoting troops' welfare are in bad taste and do not augur well for the cohesion of the Ghana Armed Forces. President Mahama last Thursday announced the increment in peacekeeping allowance for troops by $31 per month at an all-ranks deba at the Bema camp in Accra. A statement by the Ghana Armed Forces said the monthly rate per soldier as paid by the United Nations since July 2014 had been pegged at $1,332, out of which $900 was paid to each soldier on a monthly basis, with the remainder expended on pre-operational training activities, which includes feeding, clothing, medicals and other logistics and ancillary services. The statement said, with effect from July this year, the United Nations increased the monthly rate by $32, which is approximately $1.06 per day. Hence, the government's decision to increase the monthly allowance to the troops by $31 per month, which works up to $1 per day. Speaking earlier on TV3, Department of Research of the Kofi Annan Peacekeeping Center, Dr. Kwesi Engin, said the public needs to understand the context within which the increment has been done, noting that it is positive for the military. The president agreed to the peacekeeping allowances by one dollar, and quite a number of people have questioned me that one dollar is really too small. Mm. I don't think so. We need to understand the one dollar increase within the context of the, the, the opportunities are given when you vote. 